Number 16. What sound intensity level in decibels is produced by earphones that create an intensity of 4 times 10 to the minus 2 watts per meter squared? Okay, so basically we have, we need a formula that relates basically decibels or aka sound intensity level to that intensity. All right, I'm not really sure what that word was. Intensity. All right, so we have this, that beta, which is measured in uh, decibels, will be equal to 10 multiplied by the log to base 10 of the intensity that we're hearing basically divided by the threshold of hearing, which is I sub O. Now, instead of I sub O, just plug in the 10 to the negative 12th, all right, because that's a constant value. So now, all I really need to do is just plug in for this, right? So this is just 10 multiplied then by log base 10 of then the intensity that's being heard. So the earphones are producing an intensity of 4 times 10 to the minus uh, 2 divided by then 10 to the minus 12. And that's it. Calculator time, right? So first, let's do what's in the brackets, the log stuff, all right? Don't worry about the base 10 there, okay? Uh, when you calculate this, assuming your calculator has a log button, which it should, it's assumed then that the base is 10, okay? So if you just hit the log button, and then you do 4 times 10 to the minus 2 divided by 10 raised to the minus 12th, and then enter that, assuming you entered it appropriately, it would be about 10.6. And then you have to take that value and just multiply it by 10, all right? So this is about 106 point, well, point zero basically. So just 106 decibels. That would be the value, okay? Notice here when you talk about decibels, just uh, just interestingly, um, I don't know if it's interesting, but in terms of let's say you had a decibel level, you know, of 80, and then you had a decibel level, right, decibel level of let's say 90, Okay. What's the difference between these two in terms of actual, uh, in terms of how much louder a decibel of 90 is compared to 80? What do you think? Well, it's actually not, you might say, well, should I just take 90 over 80 and find like the percentage change? Actually, not exactly. This is actually 10 times, 10 times louder than this. All right. That's because of the log function here. All right. So you can basically, you can calculate that if you like, but just might be something interesting. All right. Anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully this helps. Please remember to help us out and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Take care.